Hello. Today I wanted to show you how to use the motion effect in Adobe Premiere Pro to make a basic collage for videos that you may have seen uh, similar to this where people are playing music remotely together and you want them all to be on screen at the same time. So I've done three of these panels already, but I want to show you the last one. And this is probably what you're looking at right now. Just one video on the screen and you don't really know how to see the other ones or how to organize them in any way. And my first thing I would do is go into your editing screen set. And this is probably what you're seeing actually when you open this up is this screen. And the next step is to go over here to Effect Controls, select this. Right now, no clip is selected, so we can't apply any effects. But if we select this, all of a sudden, all of these things pop up, and now we have a lot of things that we can access. If you select Motion at the very top, it won't say bottom left vid. That's something I've applied, so it should just say Motion. A blue box will appear around your video, and you can move this however you want, resize it, do a lot of the things you're probably used to just by clicking on it with your mouse in this uh, viewing window. Now, the way that I organize my projects, uh, especially if I have four panels, is I usually take this anchor point here, and rather than moving the video into place or doing anything like that, I just use math. So I bring the anchor point down here. If you hold control, the anchor point will snap to the certain points. So if this is going to be the bottom left video, I put the anchor point in the bottom left. And if you have four videos, if you change the scale to 50, you'll be able to fit four videos on the screen if the uh, anchor points are all in the respective corners that they should be for those videos. So right now, well, that one's not. Let's put that one over there. <laughs> there we go. So now all these videos have anchor points in the corners they're supposed to be in, and the scale is just set to 50. So that's a really easy way to get a four panel video. If you're going, uh, once you do this though, this is where the bottom left vid thing comes in. If you select motion again and save preset, you can save that preset and then anytime you want to put a video there again, it will show up in your effects presets. And you can get there by uh, selecting the effects panel down there or by going to window and selecting effects. And then in your presets, I have a lot of different things for five panel videos, for bottom left vid, bottom right vid, those kind of things. So I don't have to go in and do the math again, which is really nice because sometimes it takes a long time to figure out how to fit everything on the screen how you want. So uh, once you get into five panel, six panel videos, you may have to do some cropping or some really creative things to make them fit. At that point, Premiere is kind of obsolete for arranging uh, panels in a creative way. I would start to use After Effects for that and masking, but that's for another video. So I hope this video is helpful in getting you up to speed on how to make collage videos in Adobe Premiere Pro. Thank you. Bye.